What's going on YouTube? Um, I'm going to show you all something that a lot of people don't really understand how to do. Now, from my trans brake, I have a hot wire coming out. Now then, in order for the sniper to see the trans brake and to set up the two-step, it needs a ground input from that same from that same output. So I got a hot coming out and I need a ground going a ground going into the sniper. So I'll show you over here what I got. Flip this around. Okay. This wire here, let's get it in frame. This yellow wire here from the sniper goes needs a ground input to the sniper to say, okay, yeah, the trans brake is engaged. This purple wire here, see if we can get to it. This purple wire here that I have run to my trans brake button. This is hot because the trans brake needs a positive to activate the solenoid. Because if you know how trans brake works, when that's powered up, it powers up the forward the first gear and the reverse solenoids in the transmission that's what holds it in position okay now then now then um you need a relay just any this cheap old relay okay now then we're gonna flip this around and i'll show you how i'm gonna wire this so here i have the common on the relay and the ground wire tied together now i'm going to crimp that together and i'm going to put a single wire on it okay now then this white wire here that is the positive for the coil on the relay and that black wire is a negative or ground however you want to say it but anyway that will hook to my to my uh trans brake power which will power this relay and this here that will hook to that yellow wire and what that will essentially do is whenever I power up this relay it'll give the input a ground input to the sniper that way I can use my two-step with my my trans brake so that was the whole video today that I wanted to do. I just wanted to talk about how to change a hot input or a positive input into a negative input. For And you can do that with anything. It's just all in how you wire the relay. Relays are an amazing thing. They're a nice switch, but you can do a lot of stuff with relays that you can't just do. Um, but anyway, I'm going to get this wired up and i'll take a picture of it when i'm done and show you all what it is or how it looks when it's wired in all right so i'll post that in here somewhere um so anyway we're gonna get this done it looks like it's about to rain and i have to work night shift tonight so i'm gonna try and get this done and then the last things i gotta do is i gotta fill the radiator up and make sure I get all the air out of it and then red is ready to run. So this is the last thing we gotta do. Alright, y'all take it easy and have a good day.